Hey you guys, how are you guys doing today? Hope everybody's doing well. Hope you guys are enjoying the week so far. Hope you guys had a good weekend. Spirit High Honor, please show us the most dominant energies today. Whoever needs to see this. If you guys are new, welcome. Thank you so much for stopping by the channel. Keep in mind, every single energy or every single reading may not be for you. Okay. Most dominant energies for today. Sixth house. Virgo energy is there. Neptune. Okay, um, South Node came out in Aries. He's kind of slipped out of my hand, so I always like to get a proper shuffle. Um, let's let's redo this. If it comes out, it comes out. Then we know what else, Spirit? Because it kind of the way it slipped out of my hand. Okay, Jupiter. I'm gonna take that. Jupiter, learning, teaching, blessings, positivity, good luck, good fortune, growing, expanding. Some of you guys, you guys could be in school for a trade, something to do with your work, could be some type of training. Neptune, this is Pisces energy. Could be some type of confusion. This card is Okay, let's get down to it. These cards are just falling out. So, sixth house spirit, please. One card I'm going to read here Queen of Earth reversed, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn. Neptune. Knight of Water, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. It's a um, helpless romantic type of energy. Hopeless romantic, knight in shining armor. Dealing with a younger gentleman, younger woman. Somebody just more emotional, artistic, creative, psychic, intuitive. Or this is just somebody following their hearts. This could be a, f um, a feminine energy that could have confused somebody or confused somebody's feelings. Jupiter. Seven of Earth. Investments, assessments, patience. I feel like somebody was confusing someone about who to invest in, what to invest in, or where to invest in, or some type of planning, some type of plans, plans for the future. This could be somebody you work with. I feel like somebody wanted you to be of service to them. This Queen of Earth reversed. I feel like this is a feminine energy that wanted you to be a service to them, provide for them, take care of them, or um, maybe work for them. This could be a boss, or this is, um, we'll see. Whoever this is could be and have bad health. Queen of Earth reversed next to the sixth house. That could be somebody that has bad health, um, bad habits, ungrounded. Could have bad work ethic, something like that. Uh, let's see.
sixth house, queen of earth reversed. Sixth house. Forest, muddled, unclear thinking. So this, I feel, goes along with the Neptune energy. Some type of confusion. You could have put whoever this is on a pedestal or um, overly romanticized the wrong person or people, the wrong situation. Queen of Earth reverse. Cracked cup. Whoever this is is dissatisfied with their life. It looks like a woman. Could be a man too, but Queen of Earth. Uh, nine times out of ten. That's nine times out of ten. That's going to be a woman. Neptune, please. I really feel like somebody's realizing and learning that they have invested into the wrong person. Neptune. Hammock. You guys could be taking a vacation, whether this is physically or mentally. Maybe from work or your job. Night of water. Romance is in the air. Jupiter. Marriage. This marriage is out reverse. So this could be a divorce for some of you guys. Or you are learning about someone that is divorcing or the end of a contract, end of um, an agreement. Or marriage could be a divorce seven of earth four leaf clover great good fortune sixth house Forest, six tiles, middle unclear thinking. I really feel like somebody confused you. That's what I really feel. Maybe they clouded your judgment. A karmic energy. Sixth house. Okay, somebody could have a new car. You guys could have purchased a new car. You are my empress. Queen of Earth reverse, dissatisfied with life. Exchanging sex for money could be a prostitute or somebody that doesn't value themselves, doesn't love themselves, and uh, maybe sleeps around in exchange for money. Gold could be a gold digger. I'm seeing the gold diggers out a lot. Neptune, taking a vacation, physically or mentally. I enjoy being with you. Let's give, me, give me another card on this Queen of Earth reverse. co-parenting someone is only talking and only get along for the kids or a child Neptune sex magic so there's a lot of sex here night of water they have to go live with family friends or parents Maybe you're divorcing that person or this is you divorcing and living, going to live with parents. This break is very hard for me. And 
Jupiter. A new home. So somebody got a new car and a new home. Well, this was in the recent past, or maybe you're thinking about this. Jupiter. Revenge body. Seven of Earth. They don't know you like I do. So more Seven of Earth. Okay. Great, good fortune, good news. So you guys is you guys could be have gotten a raise or increase in money with your work or business. I'm trying to work on myself and be better. Awesome. Awesome for you. Awesome. Sixth house unclear muddled thinking. Alexa, lower the volume. New car. New car. Tower reverse. The sun. Leo. Hermit reversed. So there's Virgo. That's the sixth house. So y'all could be thinking about a new car for some of you guys. I really feel like somebody is... There's this energy with ghosting here you could have ghosted somebody ghosted um ghosting somebody not communicating with somebody or people there's some sort of very withdrawn energy here somebody's very paranoid about some type of destruction here I feel like this goes beyond a new car or um, I feel like you guys could have literally gotten a new car or thinking about getting a new car, but I really feel like this is somebody going in a new direction because what I'm seeing is the chariot. So this is like a chariot. So I feel like somebody's going in a new direction, could be going in a new path. Because with the sun here, something is being illuminated to you. This could be something to do with children, kids, or your inner child. This could be you healing your inner child. Sixth house also deals with healing also. I feel like somebody is, maybe in the past you were attracted to certain women that, um, women or men that had, that didn't value themselves, maybe because you didn't value yourself in the past. So this is what I feel like this is. So maybe this could be a sex worker you guys are dealing with or were dealing with or that you guys know of because somebody's been exchanging sex for money and sex magic is here, confusing somebody with this Neptune energy. Maybe this is somebody you guys co-parent with, but there's an Empress energy here too. So this Queen of Earth reverse is definitely, as obviously we know, that's not an Empress energy, so it's a karmic energy. I feel like somebody's dealing with a karmic that has a major downfall, destruction, or some type of collapse disaster coming um, could be in terms of their work career business or their money finances or their health 
um, they could have confused you in something um, regard to your health work okay or try to sabotage you in some shape or form or maybe confused you about who to be of service to maybe who to I'm picking up an energy providing for so whoever this is could have confused you about something to do with providing or providing for somebody else because there's some type of jealousy here there's a very stingy selfish energy with this queen of earth reversed insecure unstable lack lack mentality Something has become very apparent to you, though. Give me another energy here. Show me this Hermit reversed. Maybe that person is trying to get money from you for a new car. This is out by the Tower, Eight of Cups. Yeah, you've turned your back on the situation with whoever this is or a job. Or some type of experience or, or an old outdated reality. Could have definitely said goodbye to whoever this is or whatever situation this is. Cut them out of your life. Okay, and then show me this energy here with the sun. The sun. Blocked throat chakra. So, yes, yeah, somebody's not communicating. So there's a lack of communication or you ghosted somebody. Strong ghost energy. Ghost, ghost, ghost. For some of you guys, I feel like whoever this Queen of Earth reversed is this Karmic Femme. I feel like if you're Empress Energy or Divine Feminine, they could have been trying to get you to cut somebody out of your life or get somebody to cut you out of their life. Because with this Knight of Water, there is strong feelings. There is strong emotions here. Somebody does want to invest into you or this is you investing into yourself learning to invest into yourself or some type of growth this the jupiter that's pisces energy too and sagittarius so you guys could be becoming more knowledgeable reading studying definitely becoming um, more enlightened spiritually enlightened ascending Seven of Earth is, is definitely growth. is a very fertile time. Good time to invest. Maybe you guys are taking your time to assess the situation first and just patiently waiting, planning for the future, taking your time. Because good fortune, good luck is on your side. And it looks like in terms of a marriage, a commitment, or um, new car, new home, or new money, could be a new body. I see a lot of new things here. New car, new home, new body, revenge body. I feel like somebody's getting rid of a gold digger. I really feel. Maybe you're getting this is you getting rid of old habits. Maybe this is you improving your health. But there's definitely a lack of communication here. I feel like whoever that is clouded somebody's thinking, their judgment. They could have told somebody not to speak to you out of jealousy or envy. Whoever that is is getting cut out the picture for sure, for sure, or you've turned your back on them. Show me this tower reversed. Queen of Earth reversed. Or sixth house energies tower reverse the 
they are gonna, maybe they, this person could be unemployed, maybe they have to work or get a job. So I've, I've just seen a lot of things here. Tower reverse. They've got a disaster in their life. Yeah, five of swords. They look like they are, could have been some type of arguments. Definitely trying to one up somebody or in competition with somebody. Mind games. I feel like they're trying to outsmart somebody for some money, I feel. But you're already aware of this with the sun. They could have seen you in a new car. I, for some of y'all, that is a new car, but I really feel like this is just somebody. They know and see you're walking away into a new direction. You're driving in a new direction, steering away from them. It's almost like with this energy, somebody's trying to force themselves onto you or force themselves to stay uh, tied to you. Whoever this is likes to play a lot of mind games. They could be trying to seek some type of revenge also. Wow, yeah. I'm here and talk to me. Talk to me. It's like a very aggressive energy. Talk to me. It's very aggressive and very desperate. Yeah, you ghosted yourself from whoever this is. <laughs> 